Hey guys and welcome back to PlumbingPartsPro.com. Today we're going to talk about a repair coupling that might just save you in a sticky situation. Check out this video coming up next. Alright, what we have here is a repair coupling that will go over a hub. Okay, so in certain situations, uh, the most common situation that I see is, uh, for instance, someone has put in a new kitchen sink and they cut out their old PVC drain. Let's say they had a inch and a half sanitary T coming out of the wall, had some PVC pipe, had a trap running up to their sink. Well. They cut the old drain off right here. Next thing you know, it's just a short little stubby piece coming out of the wall. Okay, you still got the pipe inside here where it's glued. Okay, well now you got your new sink in and now you can't get anything back in here. Well, you got a problem. You can't connect to it. There's not enough pipe sticking out to connect to. And essentially what you've got is your wall which is a little bit of a hub coming out. What this does, it's a coupling, inch and a half, but it's an inch and a half socket by inch and a half PVC pipe, okay? Inch and a half socket by inch and a half PVC pipe. So it's a little bit bigger on one side. So what you can do is actually slide this over the hub, line that up, and then tighten this up with your uh, nut driver, just like you would a normal Fernco boot or something like that. And now you've got a secure connection, okay? Now you can go from here and run your pipe, slide your pipe in here, tighten this one down, or anything else you need to do. It works in multiple situations. Let's say under the house. You got a four inch stack with a three inch uh, sanitary T branch off, comes over, up, and then there's your toilet flange. Well, let's say this 90 cracks, okay? For some reason, something happened, this 90 cracked, okay? So now, you gotta cut that thing out right about here. Now there's no pipe left for you to connect to. So either you gotta cut the whole stack, replace the whole section, or you can take one of these, loosen up the band with your nut driver, slide this over the hub, loosen a little bit more, slides over, tap that on, and then tighten it up with your nut driver. Slide your pipe in this side, reconnect your fitting, or whatever you're using it for. But it's an advantage that you're able to connect over the hub and not have to cut the whole fitting out when you're kind of in a pinch. You don't have to cut the wall out, you know, to get to this sanitary tee. Uh, they do make tools called, for instance, like a ram bit. Uh, they're very expensive. They're uh, 30 to $50, depending upon the size. Um, and you can drill, you have to be very precise, you get like one shot at it, and you can drill the old pipe and leave the socket, but you gotta be good at it. You only get one shot. If you mess up, um, you gotta cut it all out anyway. So this is a good option, comes in inch and a half, two, three, and four inch. Uh, it's a socket by PVC Fernco coupling basically. It's not a Fernco brand, it is a generic brand, um, but it's made like a Fernco coupling. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the links in the description below in the, the description of the video and it'll take you to our store, plumbingpartspro.com. You can click on the size and go right to the, uh, the website and you can buy these for purchase. They're pretty inexpensive. Uh, they're anywhere from uh, four to eight dollars, depending on size and we'll ship them right to your home. 
Guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. If you're not a subscriber, make sure you click on the subscription button and click the bell so you get notified of every video we put up. We've got a whole bunch of videos about plumbing repair, uh, plumbing products, plumbing reviews, tool reviews. I appreciate it, and you guys have a great day.